I couldn't believe that I was sitting in the bank manager's office talking to federal agents about a check I was trying to deposit into my account, along with money I already had sitting in there. Could I really get locked up for the rest of my life? To hear the words, will spend the rest of your life in federal prison, evoked a different kind of reaction inside me. I'd seen court TV and the reactions of men and women after they got sentenced to lengthy prison terms. I'd also heard so many horror stories about doing prison time with other inmates that are dangerous and will kill you to prove a point, and that wasn't my idea of how I wanted to live out the rest of my life. I wanted to have kids and watch them grow up, go off to college, and have families of their own. Sitting here in this chair surrounded by federal officers was not the ticket. All I had to do was tell them that Alonzo gave me the check. But then where would that leave him? I'd be ratting my brother out, and that went against everything that I believed in. I was taught as a child that families stuck together. Never let anyone come between us. Our father embedded that in our family's heads. Zoe lived by those same values. So I refused to let any agent come between that. Excuse me, agents. But am I under arrest? Both agents looked at one another, and then they turned their attention toward me. No, you're not, the female federal agent replied. I stood up and walked toward the door of the bank manager's office. You know that if you walk out of here, there's no coming back, the female federal agent commented. Say no more, I told her, and then exited the office. The agents watched as the door closed shut.